More than 30 years ago, former San Antonio Mayor Howard Peak had a vision to build a series of multi-use trails along many of the creeks and rivers that run throughout the city. That vision has resulted in more than 82 miles of trails enjoyed by San Antonians, with an additional 32 miles of trails currently under construction or in the planning phase. One of the fun things is since we've been riding, there are more connections and more new trails all the time. <laughs> And the trails makes it a lot safer. You don't want to see other people on the streets, on the, even in the bike lanes. You know, I see a lot of elderly people out here getting good exercise. The proposed Zarzamora Creek Greenway Trail segment will connect and support low income and people of color that make up areas of persistent poverty and health issues. In that particular community, they haven't seen the development, the improvements as many other communities have. The trail will bring long-awaited opportunities for safe exercise, recreation, commuting, and it will lead to better health options for those in our city. Just don't look at it just a trail. So it has a health component, a social component, a transportation component. Having this trail, making this connection so individuals can go and be able to move around the city much safer it will increase the ability for them to move through and improve their health benefits. So it's just not a trail, it's, it's more than that just to this community. The city of San Antonio applied for the $25 million raise grant to help fund engineering, purchase of land, and construction of the Zarzamora Creek Greenway Trail. It will link the Westside Creek Trails with the Leon Greenway at the Via Metropolitan Transit Center. Upon its completion, it will add connections to over 50 trailheads, recreational facilities, cultural landmarks, bus stops, and employment centers. Thank you for your support of this important infrastructure project.